I am concerned about that, and in specific to the the burning of the Quran, I agree with General Petraeus that this is an act of religious intolerance that could endanger our troops abroad who are fighting the terrorists to protect us here at home. Obviously, September 11th is a day that will always be in our national consciousness, much like I'm sure people who were alive when President Kennedy was assassinated or people who were alive during Pearl Harbor. We all know where we were when, when we heard about that awful, awful attack. I live in Greensboro, and Sandy Bradshaw was one of the the attendants on the Flight 93, and those individuals courageously commandeered the plane from the hijackers, and they gave their own lives in exchange for the security of our country. I think we've got to remember the first responders who ran into the Twin Towers to help save as many lives as possible, and then the ordinary citizens that we have in our country who have provided support to so many people affected by the attacks. We actually passed a resolution calling for 9-11 to be a, a national day of service and remembrance. And I hope people in our great states can recognize that and actually do a day of service to help people. <laughs>